everyone, it is Dale. Um, I'm here today for the full review of the Druga, Druga, uh, little squonk kit. And I don't know if it's pronounced Druga or Druga. I pronounce it Druga, but someone on the Facebook group said that it was pronounced Druga. So these things need to come with pronunciations because I obviously don't know. Anyway, um, yeah, so I did do an unboxing on this. You can go back and watch that if you'd like. Um, but we're kind of going to go ahead and get into it. This is a mechanical little squonk box, and it does come with um, an RDA as well. So let's just go down and look at it. All right, so this is the wonderful packaging of the Druga Squonker. And it's like the best packaging I've ever seen in my life. Literally, all that it is, is you pull this guy off, you will open the back and everything is inside. I think it's awesome. Um, yeah, so this is the back to um, the mod itself and here's the mod, it's beautiful. Inside, you will find your little handy dandy manual and stuff. Here is the RDA that it comes with. And let me open it out of the box. Bag. Let me open it out of the bag. And here it is. You will also receive um, a bag with O rings, a um, little 510 adapter for your drip tip and a standard 510 pin. The one that comes installed in this RDA itself is the squonk pin, um, but you do have the option in the bag here to use the standard 510 pin as well. Um, yes, guys, so this is pretty much it. It is a fully mechanical, oh, I forgot, you do get a little wrench as well. Um, screwdriver, whatever you wanna call that. Uh, this is a fully mechanical squonk mod, and with the back on, it looks like this. And it does use a single 18650, and it feels amazing. Um, it's a very nice kind of what I'm going to consider like a velvet touch feel to it. Um, like it's 3D printed kind of. Uh, yeah, but as you can see, hopefully we'll get really close in on this button. It is fully mechanical. And there is no safety with this, guys. There's no way to lock the button or anything like that. It is straight up mechanical. Um, yeah, and then it comes, here's your little squonk bottle. Uh, this is a 10 mil squonk bottle as well. Your 18650 battery will fit here. You do have um, this th this guy here that twists, and that's if uh, you wanna put a different atomizer on there, you can sit it flush uh, to the connection on the bottom. So let's put it back together. Let's put the Addy on there. And we do have, we do offer a couple of different colors in this. I just really, really, really like this blue one. Um, we do offer a couple of different black ones that come with different color RDAs. Um, so make sure to check that out as well. This, uh, the RDA has a Delrin or it's Ultim, uh, sorry, it's an Ultim drip tip. And it does say Druga on the side of the drip tip, which I think is a nice little touch. Uh, when you open this, you will see a little Ultim spacer right here. That is so you can build single coil um, on this atomizer. You can also take out the little spacer and build dual coil, which I think is awesome that they uh, that it comes with one of these. I really, really enjoy the posts on this particular uh, atomizer. It all unscrews. You can literally just unscrew it with your fingers. And it's massive little post holes. 
I did find whenever I built this, I just unscrewed them all the way and slid my coils on top of each other like this inside of these little post hole things and screwed this guy back on. And it's just that simple to build on this atomizer, which is a plus. Now, um, you do have a couple of different airflow options as well. And it is very, very, oh, I hope we can see this. It is very smooth. So you can, um, you do have that, that single coil option. Let me make sure I can get it. There it is. So you do have the single coil option on this, so you can close off one side of the airflow or you can run it as dual. And that is truly how simple this guy is. Um, yeah. So I put it all back together. Let's come up and talk about a couple pros and cons with this. All right, guys. So, um, I actually had the pleasure of using one of these, I don't know, probably a month or so back. Um, we got a sample in and I had a chance to kind of play with it a little bit. I do have um, some, pros and, some pros and some cons. So my pros for this particular, hold on, I'm having a problem. My pros for this particular setup is that it's very, um, it's very light. Even with a battery in it, it's light. Um, that is one of my pros. I absolutely love how light it is. And I like the colors that it comes with. I also like the packaging. Excuse me, because you know you're not paying for packaging whenever you buy this, which I think is fantastic. I also do like this little RDA it comes with as well. It is very easy to build on. And it's aesthetically pleasing, I guess is what I want to say. Um, but some of my cons are going to be that depending on what builds you have in here, it gets hot. The stripper gets really, really hot. Um, and I have to remind myself that it is fully mechanical. There's no safety involved at all. Um, and I kind of don't like that it does not have a, a safety feature to where you can't push the button. I wish it had like a button lock, but that's not a big deal. I just have to be careful whenever I take this out with me. And I, that's probably my only con with this, besides the fact that I wish it had a different bottle. So I wish it had a different bottle and I wish that it had a button lock. And that is probably my only two real cons about this thing. Um, I also don't like that it gets really hot, but that was probably due to the build that I had. And it was the atomizer that was getting hot, guys. It was not the mod itself. Um, I was building safely, so I think that it has to do with the material of the cap, the top cap of the atomizer. It's just this, it feels like it's aluminum and it's kind of flimsy and it gets hot. But for the price of this mod and the beautifulness, <laughs> beautifulness of it, um, I do think that it's worth a shot to play around with, especially if you're looking into getting into squonking. I think that this is going to be a fairly inexpensive version of something that you could pick up to play around with. It's also really easy um, to build in. And if you're trying to get into squonking, wanting to see what it's all about, I think that this is perfect for you. And it feels nice. It's nice and buttery feeling. That didn't sound right, but it is. It's, it's very nice. Um, yeah, so if you have one, or if you have used one, or if you have any questions about it, please feel free to comment below. Don't forget to like and subscribe and all of that good stuff. And this was my review of the Druga Squonker Kit from AugVape, and you can get yours at vapewild.com. Bye, guys.